Hotline Pepper Products has just created their very first salsa based on their very popular and award-winning garlicky gringo hot sauce. This is Garlicky Gringo Salsa. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore back again with another review. Now today I have a salsa to review for you guys. Now this was sent to me from Mr. Kerry Stessel of Hotline Pepper Products located in Spring, Texas. And I've reviewed uh, many of his hot sauces. He has an amazing lineup of uh, several hot sauces. I've reviewed uh, some of them on my channel before, so make sure you check that out. But this is uh, Kerry's brand new uh, salsa very first salsa from hotline pepper products look at that label just love that logo you can't miss hotline pepper products now this is a medium salsa and this is garlicky green ghost salsa this is based on the award-winning and a very popular and best-selling garlicky gringo jalapeno and garlic hot sauce this stuff is amazing if you love garlic all of his uh, hot, hot sauces come in these nice flask, uh, six and a half ounce size bottles. So I highly recommend you check out his hot sauces. But let's go ahead and get into this salsa. It says it's gluten free, keto friendly, all natural, 100% money back guarantee. All right, here's what they say about this one, guys. Uh, it says if you're a fan of our award winning garlicky gringo hot sauce, you're going to absolutely love garlicky gringo salsa made with fresh fire, fired uh, jalapenos, and that wonderful garlic flavor, and tomatillos. All right, let's go ahead and get into the uh, ingredients on this one. This stuff just looks amazing. What an amazing color. But here's the ingredients, guys. Um, tomatillos, water, jalapenos. Now, that's fire-roasted jalapenos. Onions, garlic, salt cilantro, lime juice concentrate, and dehydrated onions. So most of the, the uh, usual ingredients that you're going to find in a, um, a salsa, verde salsa, but just look at that beautiful color. Look at the fire roasted uh, pieces of uh, the jalapeno peppers in there, but this stuff just amazing color. Look at that. Look at that green. All right, you can see those tomatillo seeds in there. Now this has the look to it guys. Now if, if you're just used to chunky tomato based salsas uh, and you've never had a verde style or a green salsa, salsa verde, this is exactly what they should look like, especially one that's been fire roasted. And you get into the consistency of this and the aroma is just amazing, but um, it's a little bit more on the, the loose side or the thin side that's the way a verde salsa in my opinion is supposed to look like you don't want this super super thick you don't want it ch uh, chunky um, it's not going to have tomatoes in it of course it's just going to have usually tomatillos and of course the jalapeno peppers but this is the kind of consistency that you want in a green verde salsa Aroma is amazing. You can smell those fire roasted jalapenos. You get the tomatillos. You can smell everything. The garlic, the onions, the zesty lime, uh, the cilantro that's in here. Um, this is just really good. Smells amazing. Just exactly like the quintessential green verde salsa to smell like. It's just amazing. All right, do a little uh, taste test for you guys. Here we go. Mm. Mm. Wow, that's good. And you can taste everything. You get the fire roasted jalapenos, you get the tomatillos, you get the onions, you get the garlic, you get the cilantro. It's not too strong in cilantro. Everything is just blended really, really nicely. And I think the fi that fire roasted jal jalapenos really comes through in this one but just really delicious not too salty um like i said you can just taste everything not too limey from the lime juice just perfectly balanced with everything that makes up a good a salsa verde now you know you could put this on chips um you could use it maybe to spice up or uh, really um enliven a guacamole a homemade guacamole 
Um, but let me show you what I did with this one, guys. I made what I'm calling the uh, uh, garlicky, gringo, cheesy, uh, salsa baked uh, chicken breast. And I had that on top of some Mexican rice with some uh, corn, tomatoes, black beans. That was so good. Cheddar cheese on top of the uh, baked chicken breast. And then, uh, you know, put some of the salsa on there and then let that finish for the last two minutes of baking till the cheese melted. That was amazing. Super good. Uh, so a highly recommended product. Uh, great job on this one, Carrie. Uh, this is really, really good. And once again, guys, uh, if you've never tried this one, I highly, re re highly recommend you get the garlicky gringo. It is super delicious. If you love garlic and you love green sauces, um, these are highly recommended. Check them out at hotlinepepper.com. That link will be down in the description. Uh, Carrie's got a brand new website, it looks like, or at least I haven't seen it. It's really nice, Carrie. Great job. Looks like he's offering free shipping on all orders. We call it Hotline Prime. You've heard of Amazon Prime, right? Well, how about some Hotline Prime from Hotline Pepper Products? And that link will be down in the description. Carrie, thank you so much for sending this. I greatly appreciate it. And guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.